Afternoon all. How are we all doing? Ready for another crack of the whip? Right, I've got it all set up. So what we've got is all of this here, apart from, I don't know, we can do the inside of that. <coughs> it's all gonna be sprayed this color. Right, 1500 uh, Mr. Finishing Surface of Black. <coughs> then when that's dry, I'm then gonna go and do the floor of the cockpit in I have to paint which colours do it. Yeah, I think I'll go with this one, the 308, because it's a slightly lighter grey. Um, as a matter of fact, does it tell you the actual colour? 36231. Well, I said I got it all set up. 36321. I don't know then. Oh, what's this? No, definitely not that. Well, mm, well that's British. No, I've got no other stuff here. No other greys that look like that. Oh, there it is, 231, there. Is that right? 231. Oh, there you go. Pop that colour. Looks a bit on the nutty side, but... Oh well, that'll do. So here's your copper colour, so I'm all them. Yeah, because they're the two outside colours. So, I'm just going to spray all this black. So, away we go! Make sure you're definitely getting in the picture here. I'm doing on the pedals. I'm going to be too precise about how far down I go in there because it's um, you're not going to see much without bloody great shroud on the dashboard. So. Just 
just do that in there a bit black as well because that's where the gun sits in and when the highlights in plastic in there showing really so that's just literally all you have to do on that uh, and then with the, no with the nose there's not really a lot in the nose really because that big patch there is covered up with that <coughs> hold on let's have a look because that goes on here like that no no point no point i knew there was no point doing anything to that right okay so that's that bit now while we've got the black out we're going to do a few other things so we got the uh Right, so we do the other side of the wheel door because that's pure white. Uh, we could do the joystick, so Aerials are black. Oh dear. Who oh, are that bees? All oh, these two bits. Got a fiend, I might know what they are. Right, put that over there, let that dry off. Uh, get those two bits out of the way. What else have we got here that can... Now, I won't bother doing all the legs in black. Ah, oh, there you go, there's a bit that needs to go in black. That's because it's part of the cockpit canopy frame. Turn it over. That's the only thing, mate. <coughs> oh, oh, dear. <coughs> well. Pretty cool. Um, I know that pipe's black, but I don't need to do any of that yet. Right, this is all later on stuff. Right, now, let's get these two out. And what I can do here is I can spray the turbine blades at the rear. And the turbine played at the front. <laughs> you could. Bollocks, yeah, do the tire. Right, so we've got the tire. Because that's going to be white at some point. Should have done the back of the tire on the other one there. Yeah. Anyway, here we go. Nothing 
got some ears in it. Can get it back. Mm. Oh, yeah. <coughs> <coughs> I see if you can. Then. Oh, no. no. I was starting too much and everyone started getting confused. Barring me. Right. Oh, yeah, must well do these. Oh, shit, what was that? and not something that was, uh, oh, this is broken off, just broken off, bastard. I don't know if I want to use that, however that was, I, I did use something, click on the thingy, never mind. Right, so that's looking pretty good. Try off nicely. Yeah, yeah. Not worth it. Right. Oh, that fans. Oh, this is bloody nuisance. Ah! Oh, God, I'm writing. <sighs> Every time I blow my nose, my ears block up. So I have to yawn or try and pinch my nose and blow against it to try and pull my ears. So I'm deaf as a poster. That's probably why I might be talking a bit quiet. And the, and the background chat's going louder. It's because I can't hear myself bloody talking half the time. So what we've done then is we've got this done here like this. Uh, now... trying to think how to do this. What is that stuff like? Because I don't really want to airbrush if I don't have to, because it means cleaning out the pop. I don't like painting this. Oh no, it's bloody brand spanking new. Sod it, right. Um, <coughs> now what I have got to help me out here is I've got this. The modern hog guide. Now, apparently there's a, a, a redo of this. So this is Jake Malemi's. It's because it's all, but this is what happens. Look, when the garage gets broken into and uh, yeah, half the half of stuff about the truck. Probably nearly a thousand pounds worth of reference now. Bloody sick man, but there we go. Right, so, <clears throat> what we need here then is, yeah, because everything's going in there, it's easy enough to do. Right, that's that one. Oh, this is the A10C. Oh, no, this is A10A still. That's A10A. Come on, where's the C for crying out loud? Oh, here we go. Right, A10C. So the dashboard is all... No, that's the A+. Plus. There's a C. Right, here we are. Now we're on the right track. <coughs> so the cockpit is pretty much all grey. Uh, black panels. So, I mean, look, to, I mean, if, if you look, this here, this panel here, just in this picture, is probably about... One is six scale, I guess. Closest to maybe one, one, eight, one, six scale. Yeah, and I mean, I know it's not a crystal clear picture. And then when you move down the scale even more, this is a crystal clear picture. Look how small these dials are getting. 
until eventually you move well away. Oh, they ain't got nuts on the sea cop, has it? It's just a little bit, look. That's it, it's just these two pages. Perhaps they were fairly new when he went and had a look. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Tread a plate on the floor. I don't know, it was built around a bathtub. I didn't think that was... Right. It's easier to spray it grey now and then spray the black afterwards because there's more black than there is grey. And the grey in that copy, the grey in that copy, I can easily mask up with sponges. And bits of tap, well, that bit there is where the fucking sink goes. So it's only really those little triangular bits. And then this is all black from there back. So it's only. It's, it's literally, it's just the floor and these couple of little bits here. So, right, <clears throat> because you can see that up here. Where is it? Oh, Jesus, tell you how much it knocks you out, these horrible flu illness things. I had a picture in here of it. With the... So that box is that box there. So you can look some like connections, seat. Yeah, do it like that. Black furry cushion, it's easy enough to make. Anyway, I'll be there all day if I keep looking at that. Right. So, what I'm going to do... Is... Tip that back in there. I had way too much I tipped out. Way too much. As a matter of fact. This is what I do. So when I want to change colour quite quick, just get a bit of tissue. Stick it in there, mop it out, throw that away, and just spray the bit out of the can in there. Back draft it up. People say it affects it. It does, but it takes quite a long time for it to do it. So you're not going to have a, an instant effect of, and then there's only a little bit as well. So just give it a good shake, and it'll buzz it all up right. Uh -oh. Good start. Right, where is it? There he is. <coughs> I don't need much of this, so what I do. Ten little drops of juice. Circles have got lighter. Right, okay, let's um, rock and roll. That's it. Don't need to worry about that too much. And then the chair.
try and experiment with it. <coughs> it works on another aircraft like that. So I'm hoping it'll work on this one. Right, and then the joystick. These two tiny little bits on the end, and these two tiny bits there. That's the only bit that's bloody grey. This is black. Right, so, so we've done this. Let me just give that joystick a quick highlight off the, off the bench here, because otherwise I'll get the paint all over the bench and it sticks. And... Right. Uh, right, so, get rid of what the drips are in there. Then do just give it a shake. Is it no, this is the right one? Oh boy, you two good? Behave. <laughs> So we'll leave that to dry for a minute, but what we will do is a piece of sponge. Basically it's got to be about this wide. Right, you get a drift. So that's gonna sit in there. And then I'm just gonna black the panels and everything out. Agent Grey, Accent Grey. Give it a shake to mix it up. And that's what we're gonna put on the front of this. So put it out away for a minute, all of that. Oh me, crikey. off the bottom yeah yeah near enough right the whole idea of this is hopefully you don't put too much on and it goes <laughs> and ruins the whole damn thing right right it is like a form of paint Thank you. 
Oh, there's a light in the camera. So it's... Get me just. It's about the best I'm going to get now. It's got in here again. Sod. Right. It's working on one side. It's not working on the other. Hey? Hey. What do you mean? Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Hang on a minute. Oh, no. You sure that ain't makeup? Because she had, she's piled a load of makeup on herself. Just with this, yeah, so you're just using panel line of wash to depict the lines of the of the actual panel against the instruments that have been slotted into the panel. <clears throat> so that's what we're trying to do there. You see, now anything else is done by where did that bloody thing go? I 
get it. Because like the other thing you need to do is when it comes to instruments and buttons Wait, no arguing that dash He's back to school tomorrow. Hey! Just with a bit of dry brushing, we're bringing out detail. But at the same time, we could. Wait, can you stop it, you two? Rupert, just remember how small she is. Hey, no, no hitting. Come on, pack it in now. Kitty! Oh, she's a little sod. Don't smack! Oh, 
it, really. And she's off. You up? Camry. Right, so I don't think we're gonna worry about that too much. paint's correctly on the sides <coughs> it's an easy fix you just dare brush it that way let's have a put it like that that's why I always keep a wet wipe handy because sometimes you get Sticky residue come from brushes. I don't know what it is, whether it's the resin in the paint or what it is, but probably my kids sodding about them all. Anyway, let's get the old, uh, as someone once pointed out, he goes, Oh, is this, uh, is that a bottle of fucker? <laughs> it was actually high grade enamel thinners. My wife wrote out on there, and I don't know why. And even she said, when I pointed it out to her, I said, so someone's pointed that out. I said, from a picture or so, I'll freeze frame. I don't know. And she said, I don't know why I wrote that, but she said, I wrote that at our old place. Great. Thanks very much. So, yeah. Oh, come on. I'd be blind. I'd get two for the price of one here. Yeah? 
I think just spray that out. Use this to so we pull the needle back and just clean the housing out a bit. And I don't, then go and put black paint all over your thumb just after you've been in that bloody bath. This is where you're trying to work with everything close to hand. Uh, right. <coughs> <coughs> oh, it's an arse to put on this poxy lid. No, still ain't having it. Anyway, leave that for a minute. Don't want much of this now, so only one tiny bit that'll do. Oh, jeez. Right, so with this, hold on to the front end. And then the that's it, and then there's the shroud done. <coughs> yeah. There you go. And then when the sea goes in there, you ain't gonna see that line. Yeah, it'll all be nice and hungy dory. And this is an easy touch up as well, so uh, where's my other basically brush? So you see where you got the line there, that's not quite how you want it. So you can just stroke upwards. Side. Don't need to do it much up there, but we're going to hold where along. There we go. Now, here's the other bit where we've got to do this again, so you can wipe the crap out of that for a minute. Use that. Button brush, as I call it. All right, let's put it out of the way before we go and knock the bloody thing right over. So the switch gear in here again is pretty much what it is. So. Uh, Actually, quite big. Whoop. Kind of gives you an effect looking like that. And then we got some.
And there you go. Now, if you wanted to pick any of them out, so say there was some red fire handle charge buttons, um, they're easily done. You just pick them out with um, toothpick, or just anything, anything sharpen up really, and uh, you can just you know, put it in there, like the screen, for instance. I suppose that'd be a green colour. Oh, I got my nose. <coughs> Well, it's nearly an hour, chaps. Sorry to take up your time. Hopefully you'll just be watching this in the evening, chilling out, listening to that soppy music I've got on. Hopefully it chills you out. <laughs> I chilled all the kids out the other night, they all fell asleep. I was well chuffed. I thought, blimey. So me and the missus had a bloody quiet night last night. No screaming, no shouting. Kids all gone to bed by eight o'clock. I thought, lovely. Same thing tonight. Only thing is, these two have been at each other, so just got to hope that uh, they uh, calm down. Right, so that's that. Hang on, I've got to blow the fr freeway on. <laughs> I don't like about blowing noses is your top lip gets sore as hell, especially when you've got a bit of a moustache growing back, which I have to get rid of. So, right, so, oh yeah, the other thing is quick dobby here in the black. Paint the handle. I've actually got an 18 joystick and throttle set in my garage, which I bought when I used to do flight simming, would you believe it or not? And I've got an F16 one as well. This is rather nifty. Uh, right, yeah, what was on here that I thought myself? So, hang on a minute. If you can't tell already, you can tell the boy's whistling something out of Top Gun movie. <laughs> I don't even think he's seen it yet. So, there is the thing, and there is the seat going in. So, There's your copy so far. So it's uh, look in the part, as they say. Look in the part. Now, obviously, this little circle here. Um, that's like a little. It's like a magnifying glass, but it's silver. So I'll just take that out there. They do say if you want people to stay interested in your videos, don't make them too long because they can sit there and nod off halfway through them, which is what I'm starting to do now in my own video. Or they just lose interest because you're just spraying things. That's why I don't really know what to do, but if they are of... Well, I don't know how to edit. Simple as that. <clears throat> if I knew how to cut things down or whatever, but... I don't know, people have turned around and said, you know what, mate, keep doing what you're doing, because you're doing all right. So that's what keeps me going, but um, I wish I was like my um, my cousins. Um, they're all in the film industry, and uh, yeah, they know how to edit, and their, their, their sons and daughters are all within the film industry as well, because obviously following mum and dad. Uh, very nice, you know. Um, 
<coughs> obviously they uh, their latest film that they bought out was that horror film called Megan I don't know whether any of you have seen it but uh, that's my cousin's film and uh, yeah she did have a word with um, one of the people that's now employed by Qatar his name's Paul Ain't and um, he done the models for the film Hobbit and uh, he turned around and said why isn't this guy in the filming industry but then Covid took over like it bloody does and that was me forgotten about and since then one of my cousins has fallen ill um, with a brain tumour so hopefully Kieran I don't know whether you watch these or whether your auntie uh, Wendy watches them, but, uh, you know, hopefully, mate, you're all right and that you're pulling through. God bless you, pal. Um, <clears throat> yeah, but, um, yeah, they, they kind of, like, I think that's where all this arty-farty stuff comes. <laughs> arty-farty is modern, isn't it? Oh, well, it's, it's a form of art, I suppose, isn't it? Yeah. Um, you know, so that's where it sort of, all the stems are somewhere down the line. It was on my mum's side. They, uh, they were all, you know, budding artists of different kinds and different different sorts. They went into the film industry, I didn't. <laughs> but uh, yeah, because they, um, I remember when, uh, it was just before the the, the, uh, the Lancaster, the, the Border Models Lancaster came out. Um, I asked my cousin, because she knew, she knows Peter Jackson. And, uh, I asked her whether she, whether he would be able to send one my way, you know, just uh, one that wasn't, because it wasn't finished then, and they were still doing it. And, um, <coughs> yeah, they, they, they couldn't send it because lockdown came on. He shut the business down. Can't remember what for, but... He shut the business down, and that was the end of that. And so here we are. But as it is, somebody else has bought the lank out, I think Nigel, on Nigel's modelling bench, he's, uh, I don't know what part he's up to, but he's, he's cracking it out there. Anyway, he's the only one I know who's done a build on it, I think. I don't think I've, uh, I don't think I know anyone else who's done a build on it. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah, anyway, like I say, this is boring chat, so. Um, right, so what I'll do is, um, that's pretty much finished now. There's not really a great deal of colour in these modern copies. It's all on the screens, and there's only when they're turned on. So what I'll do is I'll finish it off, uh, which is just uh, not really a lot to do, but um, paint the rest of the seat up, the cushions. Uh, That's about it, really. And, uh, yeah, if there is anything that uh, needs doing to it, then um, I'll, uh, I'll uh, accomplish the mission. So there's only there's the joystick there. Whatever, they're not normally grey, they're normally black, so it's got paint the trim tab silver there. And there's a little silver bit around the collar for the where they lock the, the hand wand to the stick. And um, yeah, and so that's it. So uh, without further ado, let's just see if I can get it up there a bit. Yep, there we go. So, without further ado, I shall now say bye-bye. Take care. If you like, then like it. If you don't, so what? It's here. It's for your entertainment. And it's for you to make, you know, see how people do things. Make a better model yourself. I'll help. Anyway, I can help. Um... Uh, so I'm sharing it. So I've got more to share. So with that, like I say, see you later, people.
Take it easy, take care, and stay out of harm's way.